Welcome to the world of Maison Berger Paris. Episode 3, Working as a Nose to Bring Magic to Life. For Aude Mas Vincenti, the nose of Maison Berger Paris, the aroma released by Lamberger is almost magical. It's so alive. But just how does this fragrance arrive in our homes? In this episode, Aude, who carefully develops all the perfumes for different rituals of Maison Berger Paris, tells us how she selects and assembles notes from her aroma library to create a fragrance. First and foremost, the job of nose is not just about chemistry. Creating a perfume always starts with one essential step, imagining its very essence. So Aude puts a little of herself into every scent. When she's looking for a perfume, she starts by identifying a note that's missing from the Maison Berger Paris range. The range is organized by olfactory family. For example, there are floral, woody and spicy, gourmand, clean and light, and even fruity perfumes. Once the missing note has been identified, she checks that it matches to current olfactory trends as well as the raw materials in vogue. As it happens, home fragrances often follow the same olfactory movements and trends as traditional perfumery. This research gives odd ideas for perfumes. Each idea must complement, balance, and energize the existing range of perfumes. For each new fragrance created, she contributes from her personal aroma library, her olfactory memory, in a manner of speaking. She is inspired by many things, including fine raw materials, their stories, and the sensory environments they create, as well as experiences that have impressed her, including recent memories, or memories from her youth or childhood. Maison Berger Paris has recently partnered with Lolita Lempica, a famous French fashion designer and perfumer, to transpose the emblematic body fragrance into an olfactory experience for the home. This range of home fragrances allows consumers to rediscover the perfume they wore in their 20s in the form of an ambient scent, awakening a host of memories and emotions. A wonderful prospect, once she has chosen the aroma, Odd becomes a narrator. She writes her concept, her story, in the form of an olfactory brief for a team of perfumers who will then materialize the aromas conceived and described as fragrances. Words, pictures, and personal anecdotes are used. The goal is for the perfumers to draw on what the chosen notes represent for the nose before starting to develop the fragrance. As Odd was looking at her Facebook page, Entirely by chance, she stumbled across a raw material that she was unaware of. Magnolia liliflora, or lily magnolia, which has a distinctive flower in shades of pink and white, resembling a small bird when still in bud. Odd's imagination immediately conjured up delicate, floral, feminine, and powdered worlds. This laid the foundations of a wonderful story, that she then just had to narrate to the magicians, the expert perfumers. The perfumers then got back to Odd with several olfactory proposals, which she tested blind in various living or working areas. While her sensibilities play a fundamental role in conceiving fragrances, Odd sometimes chooses a fragrance that she doesn't necessarily like herself, but which is the best match for the olfactory brief and which appeals to the widest audience possible. For this, the perfume must be well-balanced, have good volume and relief, and flawless olfactory qualities. Personal taste must not take precedence, only quality. Once the perfume has been approved at an olfactory level, it undergoes a full spectrum of technical tests in a laboratory before being put on the market after about a year of work. This ensures that the Lamberger releases only controlled substances into the atmosphere, while working the magic of high-end home fragrance. The nose's personal involvement ensures that every perfume tells a wonderful story and attracts different fans of the Lamberger. This internal expertise is also what makes Maison Berger Paris special. More than just diffusing aromas, 
Maison Berger creates home fragrances with olfactory compositions that are sometimes as complex as those found in typical home fragrances. There are some simple rituals that contribute to our everyday well-being. Taking the time to grind your coffee so that you can savor it to the fullest, or lighting your lamp berger to imbue your home with a delicate fragrance. These are pleasures to enjoy on your own or to share. The intention for each new fragrance by Maison Berger Paris is to activate our senses and our imagination at the same time. Another way to keep this promise is to pay particular attention to the design of the lamps. In the next episode, we'll tell the story of how, over the years, the Lamperger has become a work of art and an object passed on from generation to generation. A podcast by Maison Berger Paris.